Hey everyone, it's Jo from Expert Home Tips. Today we're going to be sharing some of our favourite uses for the pink stuff, including some unbelievable results. Be sure to stick around for the end where we show you the best use of all. If you've not heard of the pink stuff, it's a popular product among the online cleaning community. The packaging only lists a few uses, so we're going to put them to the test and try a few more. We're always updating our website, experthometips.com, so for even more uses for the pink stuff and handy tips, make sure to check out the link in the description below. So what exactly is the pink stuff? It's a tough cleaning paste that can be used to remove stains and grime from just about anything. The household cleaner is mildly abrasive, getting all of the dirt off without all the hard work. Even though it's a little bit abrasive, it's made from natural ingredients, so it's gentle on surfaces. If you're wondering what these natural ingredients are, you'll find them listed here on the packaging and in a data sheet on the Detergent Product Information's website. It's good to know that the pink stuff is not tested on animals, and it's even endorsed by the Nature Watch Foundation. If you have a question for the manufacturer, just head to their website, Star Brands Limited, where you can make an inquiry. Before we show you our favourite uses for the pink stuff, let's quickly cover how it's used. This is really important as it applies to almost every surface. Step 1. Scoop a blob of the pink stuff out of the pot using a cleaning cloth or a sponge. Step 2. Spread the paste onto the area that you wish to clean and scrub gently in circular motions. We suggest leaving the product for a couple of minutes so it can work its magic. Step 3. Rinse your cloth and use it to remove the paste. Step 4. Remove any remaining residue with clean water. Don't skip this step or you could be left with smeary marks. Now let's get cleaning with some of the best uses for the pink stuff. Don't forget we're leaving our favourite one till last. We'd love for you to comment if you can think of any that we haven't included. Let's start with cleaning the hob. This hob has definitely seen better days but as we explained before you just take a scoop of the pink stuff and rub it in. You can see just how much grime it's lifted up already. Continue to work the paste in until all the dirt is gone and use a dampened sponge to remove it. Just look at that difference and hardly any elbow grease was required at all. Number two on our list is to clean your oven door. It's a job that everyone hates doing but the pink stuff will make your life so much easier. No harsh chemicals are needed here, just scrub the paste in, rinse and reveal sparkling results. Next we're going to try the pink stuff paste on our sink. Our sink has a lot of limescale buildup, so this could be a really hard job. For problem areas, use an old toothbrush to work the paste in. This one definitely gets a big thumbs up. Look how shiny the sink looks and all that limescale is gone. If you're squeamish, look away now. This one's pretty gross. The pink stuff is brilliant for cleaning up any soapy scum in your bathroom. Avoid cross-contamination by changing out sponges between different areas of your home. And just like that, it's safe to look again. Now we've got a lifesaver for parents. A tiny blob of the pink stuff will remove any mark from your wall. Just be sure to do a patch test because this won't work on every type of paint. Let's move on to tiles. Ours are covered in grease from cooking. Using an old toothbrush we scrubbed away and in no time all of the grease had come off and the grout was looking so much whiter. Here's a popular idea. Brighten up an old pair of shoes with the pink stuff. Some people will use it to clean the fabric too, but we wouldn't recommend that. Carefully clean the paste off with a wet paper towel and your shoes will look brand new. Now it's time for the best use. No matter how hard we tried, we could not get the discoloration off this pan, but with a bit of the pink stuff and some scrubbing, it comes off so easily. Don't believe us? Just look at the results. Thanks for watching our video on uses for the pink stuff. If you found it helpful, please don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell to turn on notifications. Let us know if you've made it this far by leaving a home hack in the comments below and we'll see you next time for more expert home tips.